So I had my first uh, woodworking booth this past weekend uh, at a car show. Um, it was definitely not a, you know, like arts and crafts type of show. So having, you know, said that, didn't sell a damn thing. But I was kind of half expecting that. Um, had my little chair thing that I made, put a little succulent cactus in it. Um, had my plane and ice chest cooler box, uh, some crates, the toolboxes with the tools, some birdhouses, um, business card holders. I had a 17 inch computer monitor with my little 13 inch uh, laptop down below so you could see the video on the monitor. Uh, it showed up okay. Uh, once the sun really got to it, it didn't. Uh, you know, it didn't show all that well, but you know, people got the idea. Um, the only saving grace was I had a couple of cases of water in the garage, so I made this little sign and hung it on the ice chest cooler box and had that out front. So I actually sold about 50 bottles of water. Um, the the food vendors were more towards the middle of the show, and I was towards one end. So all the people that didn't want to walk all the way back to the uh, um, food vendors to, to get a water can pick one up at, at my booth, and it showcased the cooler box. So that was uh, it was definitely a, a good thing, and you know if I can at future booths, I'm probably going to do the same thing just because people can open it up and see, oh, you know, that's what this is. So, like I said, I, you know, didn't really expect to, uh, to, to, you know, to sell anything. You always get that hope that you can, but, you know, it is what it is. It's a good experience. Uh, handed out quite a few cards. Um, had a couple people that, you know, sounded in interested in getting a cooler box custom made for them uh, with certain colors. Haven't heard anything back yet, but we'll see. Um, usually, you know, right now I'm averaging 20, 25 new subscribers, um, a day on my main channel, and for the first, like, three days after the, the car show, I was averaging 45 to 50. So I'm really hoping that that's what that was from. Um, after I'm done here talking, I took, uh, you know, 30, 45 seconds of video on my iPhone, and, um... Um, just of what the booth looked like and what the car show looked like in that area. Um, if you'll see, my booth is right next to the t-shirt booth, and you know I'm in the car club holding the show, so I was actually in charge of the t-shirt booth. So you know I, I was just in between those two all day long. But anyway, uh, take a look at the video. Um, tell me what you think of the booth. Tell me what you think I could change. Uh, you know if anybody has any constructive criticism. You know, please, you know, put it down in the comments, you know. What can I change? What can I do different? Um, I definitely feel like I should have had more product. I just, you know, between making videos for the main channel and, you know, my day job and the kids, I just don't have that much time to uh, make that much stuff. But uh, last weekend, I made some trellises for my wife. Uh, she is, um, you know, doing the garden stuff. Uh, out in the backyard, so I, she wants some trellises, so I made her some trellises, so that'll be next week's video. Um, Summer's Woodworking is having their 2x4 contest, and I can't, I totally meant to enter last year and never got around to it, so uh, I need to go buy a 2x4, and I'm trying to think of something to make that doesn't sound like a traditional woodworking project. Um, yeah, you know, I'm. I get the wheel spinning, trying to think of something where you look at it and say, "Oh, it never occurred to me I could even make that out of wood, let alone out of a two by four. So that's what I'm. You know, that's my goal is to make something that you just, you know, wow, I didn't even think about making that out of wood in the first place, let alone a cut up two by four. So we'll see. I've got till the end of the month, uh, which you know is a couple weeks, maybe three weeks. So anyway. That's uh, my whole big, um, you know, booth experience. So, um, does anybody know 
any arts uh, craft fairs coming up in Southern California, you know, put it down in the description. Um, I don't know where to look. I mean, I imagine they should have them, but I don't know where to look. Uh, hopefully something in the Inland Empire area or Orange County, uh, so I don't have to drive too far. But I, I just want to go check one out. I, you know, what are other you know people making? You know, what kind of their displays look like? You know, what can? How much does it cost? You know, booths at car shows that I go to are expensive. Um, you know, they usually start at 150, 200 bucks, and you know, I, I want to go for you know, look at some of these places, see what kind of stuff they have set up, how much stuff, how much it costs, you know, and hopefully, you know, do something uh, more of it next year. But anyway, thanks for watching. Stay after the jump. You can see the booth, um, and I might throw in me painting the plane. So thanks for watching. See you next time.